Hey now, Mike Shaman here, and I'm going to show you how to customize the video module and the Divi theme. So this tutorial video is just going to be on customizing the video module and the Divi theme. I've got a new page open. I'm just going to go to video right now, and I use this to embed my videos in from YouTube. So I'm just going to go and uh, delete this video, and I'm going to go grab another video. This is one of my videos, and I've just gone to the share button right here, and this little box pops up, and you can share it a number of places. You can embed it if you want. If you use the embed code with the Divi theme, you want to make sure that you use the code module to insert the embed code there okay but if you want to use just the share code just use copy and that's what I use and then you want to go to the video video back to the video module and go to add video then let's go to insert from URL and then that's where you want to paste your code go to insert in the post all right and now I'm just gonna go to check and there's my video so it's inside of a row as you can see and there's space on top of it and space on the bottom of it what we can do is we can just go to this video module the settings here and we can kind of just play the settings a little bit so if we wanted to add a border which is probably the best thing you can do is add a border to it just so it gives it a little bit more of a, a formal look so you can do you know I like to stay usually between three and five just to myself, but you can do a thicker one and then you can choose your border style down here. Okay, if you do double or groove, groove is nice. So you can go through a number of different styles with the Divi theme right here. Outset, outset's nice and you can choose a little bit darker color. All right, and you see, see how it does this little nice effect here. Let's go to check, that's a little bit different. Now, if you want to do something a little bit different, just go to design and box shadow. And then we just put a little box shadow on and it makes it pop out just a little bit more. All right, if you wanted to do an inside shadow, you can do that right here. And then you want to, you probably want to want to increase the blur strength on it, depending on how big your border is and what kind of background you have on there. I usually like to stay with the blur shadow right here myself. So just play around with that until you get to where you like it. All right, and then you can just do the shadow colors. You know, maybe you want a little bit darker, just put up a little bit. And now let's go to something else that we can do with it and or actually let's go back to content and you'll see an option here for overlay if you click on overlay and go to add image you can also go generate from video but i just like to go to add image and i just pick my own overlay right here and i just go to check now this size is 1920 by 900 my overlay actually is the actual size of it but uh, you just want to make sure it's like a rectangle overlay there so you can see what it is. And then what's pretty cool about the Divi theme and the Divi theme builder and the video module is you go to design and play icon and then you can change the icon within the Divi video module here. All right, so you can make it smaller, bigger. All right, now if you go to overlay, you can change the overlay background color too and you can do different stuff if you have a... Um, all right, and if you want to change the overlay color, so if you roll over it, you can see that. So if you want to change that, you can... I like to make mine black and actually if you go to black and a little bit down here on the overlay color here just a little bit down all right play icon check that all right and let's see you can make it bigger play yep that looks good now you can go to box shadow play this box shadow if you want but let's see down here any animation nope all right, check. So it looks pretty good. There's a little overlay. So it looks like a good little video module. Now you get a duplicate and we can just work from this one. Just go to settings here. Now we can do something a little bit different. If we just go to design and border. All right, maybe you want to make it a little bit different. So what we can do is we can just go to the, the side borders here and just bring these side borders down. Maybe you only wanted to have a top and bottom one, but it was solid, kind of like a, a theatric look. So let's go here you know of course still within YouTube there but that's a cool little theatric look and of course we want this color to be black okay we can up this a little bit more as well and if you did want the sides you could do the sides you know maybe just use one a little bit okay five pixels and then five pixels now what you could also do is if you want to size this down a little bit, maybe you want to make this size this a little bit smaller, you just go to sizing and you want to scroll down on width, okay? And you can put it in the middle if you wanted. And you can also change the minimum height if you want that as well, but I, I recommend not changing the minimum height, I recommend just changing the width. All right, now you just leave it 100%, and then if you were to go to a two column, it would uh, shrink down with it. So just take this and put it in here. Oh, I was actually moving the row and not the module. 
All right, now if you did want to get all that spacing between those rows down, you just go to the settings of the row, go design and spacing, and you just take it down to zero here. All right, and then your video would hug that row. Okay, same for this one. If you wanted to make this video design and spacing, just make this margin zero top and bottom and this padding zero top and bottom. And now your video hugs that row, just like it hugs this video now because we have zero spacing there, okay? So if we throw this row out, all right, you can see a nice video there. Now if we just go to setting and background of the section, just kind of dice it up a little bit here. Make it a, let's see, just make it a light gray, looks good. And you can also go back to settings and design and sizing, and then you can just increase the, um, actually if you go to content and design and spacing, just increase the padding a little bit on the bottom there. Check. Now you got a cool little video in there. And I might just even do good do the shadow again on this one and just make it a little bit more so the video stands out on this page. All right, and that's what you can do with the video module. So it's one of my favorite things to customize with the Divi theme. So I hope you guys got a lot of value of this tutorial and some uh, cool little tricks that you can do with the Divi theme and the video module. If you got value out of this video, go ahead and hit the like button, hit the subscribe button, and I'm sure you'll get some value out of my other Divi theme tutorials that I have. So go ahead and check those out as well. All right, I'll see y'all on the other side.